Hi friends. Today let us discuss about the performance equation for nth order kinetics. Those who are preparing for gate, which is very important to recap this session, please go through the complete session so that you will get an idea when you solve problems in examination. So at the end of the video, we will come to know which performance equation we have to apply quickly so that we can solve some of the problems. The performance equation for nth order kinetics where we have the order of reaction n is equal to 0 and n is equal to 1 and second order reaction n is equal to for any nth order reaction when we discuss about the rate equation minus r a is equal to k into c a power n. So if we see here for zero order reaction the rate of reaction minus r a is equal to k. k tau by c a naught is equal to x a this is the performance equation which we need to use for a, a single reaction when we have a single reaction minus r a is equal to k for zero order reaction where we can use x a is equal to k tau by c a naught for a plug flow reactor. So you should be very careful. So what type of reactor it is and then when we have a mixed flow reactor for a zero order reaction where we can use the same equation x a is equal to k tau by c a naught. For a first order reaction when we have a pl plug flow reactor and then a first order reaction the rate equation if they give it as minus r a is equal to k into c a sometimes they give k value right like 0.05 or 0.01 so based on that where we can have uh, we can calculate here tau so sometimes they may ask you to calculate the conversion of a plug flow reactor. Right. So that based on that, based on the stoichiometric equation, whatever the stoichiometric equation given, we calculate epsilon A and then we substitute epsilon A here. So sometimes where we need to know, they give the volumetric flow rate and volume of plug flow reactor. So we can write it as tau is equal to V by V naught. And as per the rate equation given, where K value which they will be give, given, so k tau is equal to 1 plus epsilon a ln 1 by 1 minus x a minus epsilon a x a. So the values of the epsilon and k tau values if they give for a first order reaction then you can calculate the conversion of a particular plug flow reactor. In the same way when we have a mixed flow reactor so you need k and tau value and epsilon a for a particular mixed flow reactor when they have when they uh, when we have a mixed flow reactor so they they give the volume of a reactor and then the volumetric flow rate the inlet conditions right and then we need to calculate the conversion what is uh, x a so if you want to calculate the conversion of a particular mixed flow reactor we uh, apply this equation for a order of n is equal to 1 and when we have a second order reaction so n is equal to 2 so for a single reaction we can write the rate equation minus r a is equal to k into c a square so once you have uh, uh, for a plug flow reactor right so you can have uh, the performance equation and in the same way where we can directly apply for a mixed flow reactor in some of the problems we are going to uh, solve it so we are going to apply uh, these equations directly hmm? so you should be very careful first you write down whenever you solve a problem you write down what type of uh, reactor it is whether it is a mixed flow reactor or whether it is uh, a plug flow reactor right so here you need to be very careful for applying the particular equation whether it is a mixed flow reactor or a plug flow reactor right for any uh, nth order reaction like general equation where minus r a is equal to k into c a power n where we have already solved it uh, for, for this. We have a first order reaction, a reversible reaction. So this is a, a reversible reaction. A gives rise to r. So the performance equation based on a plug flow reactor or a mixed flow reactor is given in such a way. And when we write the general expression here, the general expression 
for tau space time tau is equal to ca naught into integral 0 to xa dxa by minus ra is for a plug flow react tau by ca naught is equal to xa by minus ra is for mixed flow reactor so let us see some of the important equations where you can apply uh, directly for solving problems when you uh, have a competitive ex for appearing for gate examination. So the general ideal reactors when we have discussed the ideal reactors right, for a single reaction we can write down for suppose for uh, a batch reactor. When we have a batch reactor where you can write T is equal to CA naught into integral 0 to XA DXA divided by minus RA into 1 plus epsilon A XA and then what, what is what is tau so tau is equal to 1 by S space time is equal to 1 by space velocity and then CA naught into V divided by FA naught which is equal to V by V naught. So you can directly apply this equation. So tau is equal to V by V naught which is equal to 1 by S right which is equal to C A naught divided C A naught V by F A naught. So in some of the problems where if you want to calculate the volume of a batch reactor. So you have the values like uh, uh, concentration initial concentration and uh, FA naught feed rate so we can have the tau value or the volume the volume of a particular uh, reactor whether uh, it is a batch reactor and then when we have uh, a, a mixed flow reactor for MFR you can see here where V by FA naught is equal to tau by CA naught which is tau by CA naught is equal to XA by minus RA and where we can write here so tau is equal to 1 by S which is equal to V by V naught is equal to V CA naught divided by FA naught is equal to CA naught XA divided by minus RA so you should be very thorough with all these things so when we have a mixed flow reactor if they ask you by giving the other data so that you can calculate the volume of mixed flow reactor right? sometimes they may give the volume of mixed flow reactor where you can calculate V naught so by giving stoichiometric equation like A gives rise to R and then the volume of a mixed flow reactor if the volume of mixed flow reactor is given. So the rate equation they may give minus RA is equal to K into CA. So the K value which may be given K is equal to 0 0.01. So where you can calculate directly uh, the volume of a reactor or volumetric flow rate. right? So and then the other reactor is a plug flow reactor. So where we have V by FA naught is equal to tau by CA naught is equal to integral 0 to XA. XA means this is XAF into DXA by minus RA. And then the other equation where we can write tau is equal to V by V naught is equal to V CA naught divided by FA naught is equal to CA naught into integral 0 to XA DXA by minus RA. So you should be very clear about this uh, uh, equations, the performance equations for a batch reactor, mixed flow reactor and plug flow reactor before solving the problems. In the next video we will discuss in detail some of the problems so that you can understand how to apply for a particular type of a reactor.